There we go. Now we're back. Sorry. We messed around with the minute, or we messed around with the settings for a minute to get it 16 by 9. Uh, this is about as good as I think we can get 16 by 9 to look. Um, I used to have a donation button under my stream. I don't right now because there were some problems with some people in the community um, doing some fucked up shit because of it. Um, so there's that. Maybe it's my capture device. It probably is. All right. How does this look for y'all? Not going to turn on progressive scan. Is it just me or does this look a little weird? Looks pretty good. Looks fine. Good. Okay. The frame rate's a little bit awkward, but if you guys are happy, it's whatever. Progressive scan. I don't know what the fuck this is, but we'll turn it on. What? Uh, yeah. I don't think I can. It's all pixely. It would be. Um. Uh, okay, so I can't because my thing does not support 16 by 9 apparently. All right, we're going to this one. Yeah, if you want a higher frame rate, but I've heard that the PS3 version has some issues. Oh, looks like the music or the uh, cables have gone out. This is what happens, you know. This is just part of streaming. Inevitably, something goes wrong, and we have to fiddle around with the settings for several minutes, and it stresses me the fuck out. Hopefully, we have sound again. We don't. Why do we not have sound? Uh, let me try recapturing. <sighs> PS2 streaming can be very finicky. Um, let's make sure that... Okay, set. We might have, uh, there's some crackle, which is a good sign. Okay. Yeah, the PS2 is a very blurry system, to be honest. I could probably get a better FPS and probably get a better, um, everything. If I use, like, an emulator, honestly. But, uh, yeah, this is about 30 FPS. Probably closer to 24. Um, it's not great, but, you know, this is just how this game runs, unfortunately. Okay. Yeah, uh, troubleshooting in front of an audience is one of the most stressful things, because I'm not terribly great at computers in the first place, and you throw in the fact that probably half of you guys are more experienced or have a better understanding of how to fix these problems than I do. And of that half, half of you are lying or actually don't know. Um. Oh. It's just, uh, I don't like it. So. Now, I have a feeling he's over here. I kind of forget. I know there's one that's out in this forest, and I believe it's the turtle. Are we doing the turtle? What you have looks good? Okay. Well, that's all that really matters. Yeah, I mean, th this game has some issues as far as graphical fidelity and frame rate and a lot of those things. Um, and it's just sort of... Uh, I've also turned on the background blur. Uh, I don't know what it's going to look like. Um, don't let a bunch of harmless... No, nah, it's, it's not so much intimidation as much as it is, like, you know... I want to make sure that you guys are, are happy and all that, so. I think there's a way to cheat this, but I do remember that there's one of those salamanders up here. We're going to try and get him. This is, uh, this is the fourth or fifth one, and I honestly don't know. It says we've defeated five, so I guess this might be six, actually. Wait a minute. Is that it over there? That's it right there.
Sorry, lizard. There we go. Got it. Alright, so if I jump down there, I'm most likely going to break my legs and die, right? That's just one of those things, because water tension is a, a thing, and it is very real. Uh, I'm playing on uh, actual PS2, so that would explain a lot of the issues that we're having. There's a lizard every save shrine. If I don't see it immediately, then it's not happening. I'll tell you that much. Oh. Yeah, this game is great. Save then jump. You can't just save anywhere. You gotta save at uh, the shrines. And I can pretty much guarantee that that's what's gonna be what happens. But this game is beautiful. Despite the fact that it kinda is a little bit pixely. It's got a lot of bloom to kinda cover up some of its rough edges. Um, that's a good game. It really is. Uh, I have not tried the... I'm playing on the PS2 original, yeah. Okay. Yeah, the horse in this game is incredibly realistic. Incredibly well done, okay. I'm not a huge fan of Ico. Maybe I should give it another shot. It's the same developers as this. It's like a possible prequel, or this is the prequel to that, or I forget. Um, but, uh... Oh, oh, this is a sand one. Is this a sandworm? Okay. Yeah, this is this one. I like this one. His hooves are kind of going all over the place right now. He's kind of tripping himself, but whatever. Okay. This is the sandworm. Or is this the flying one? I forget. Ico is the sequel. Alright, where am I going? Give me a sign. Right there. Right there. Okay. I should be right on top of it, yeah? Looks like a 240p video. It's probably about 480p upscaled to 720p. So it's about as good as a PS2 can look with the hardware setup we've got. Unfortunately, I have a really shitty capture card because the capture card that I actually like does not fucking work. I'm not a huge fan of Aver Media anymore. Um, so I don't think that we're in the right area. I think we need to... Are we not in the right area? It feels like we're not. A shout out to Doris, Dorism's sister? Sure. Happy birthday, Dorism's sister. Um, I have no idea what your name is, but happy birthday to you. How about this? I'll just like, I'll stop for a second. Here. Happy birthday. And, and then you can just like cobble together parts of my speech that I've said before. And then you can make it sound like I actually said happy birthday to her. And then it, it, it'd be special. Get on that video editing. There you go, you got it. Now you're like the best older brother or sister or whatever. No, I actually don't need your help for this, Agro. I was just, um, I just, okay. No, it's, it's good, Agro. You don't need to come down. I got this. I've kind of forgotten the controls since last time. Let's jump again. It's clearly not any of the buttons that I'm pressing. Uh, is it triangle? It is triangle. Oh, there we go. And now we go down the stairs. Is this one? Is this one of the shitty colossi? Is this the one, the, the lizard one? Oh. 
Oh, it's the beard bear. There we go. Kind of forgotten some of the controls. It's been like a week or so since I played this. Yeah, I don't like the smaller ones. The smaller ones are kind of boring, in my opinion. Oh, it's this one! I remember this one now. Okay, this one's cool. I like this one. Because this one has a really cool, like, play area. This is the one that looks like Gandalf. Okay. What is this game? This is Shadow of the Colossus. It's one of the best games ever made, in my opinion. Um, though I have really weird taste in video games, I've learned. I was talking about Mike, or talking to Mike about this the other day. And, uh, I just, there are a lot of games that I'm just not interested in that are coming out. But I love this. I love this game. And I love, Sh um, Star Fox 64. Journey was good. Um, I won't say Journey was much of a game, but it was beautiful. They're making another game, so I, I sent away to see if I can maybe get an early access copy of that. Something about swimming. But it looks pretty. So dark. Can I, uh... That makes it a little bit better. It's less so that way I can see and more so that way you guys can see, because, um... The PS3 had an HD remaster, that is true. Um... This is a solid game. And worth all of the praise that it gets. I'm gonna... Just climb over here. I, if I recall correctly... Uh, you just want to run over here. You need to get him all the way over here to be able to do shit. Okay. I do have a capture card. Have I played Metal Gear Rising? I haven't played any of the Metal Gear games. I should probably move. I have a uh, Dazzle and an Aver Media, but the Dazzle actually works. Okay. Um. Oh, okay, that was a pretty direct smack. No, I'm okay. Oh, okay, I'm getting hurt here. I'm trying to figure out where I need to be on him. Um, clearly not where I'm exactly standing. I'm gonna bolt. Uh, oh, shit. Um... Uh... I don't know where to go on him. I know I need to climb him, but I don't know exactly where. Jesus. Okay. Uh, can I climb this? I can climb this. I can get up this. There we go. It's just been a while since i played this game, so I've completely forgotten how to play. Okay. I'm gonna hold my sword on my belt rather than... in my hand, because I need him to... He knows I'm here, you know? Uh, 
There we go. Got it. Uh. Oh, God. There we go. There we go. He's going to buck me off, probably. And it's going to hurt like a bitch when he does. But let's see if we can get a stab in. That should keep him kind of busy for a sec. Get a couple of stabs in before he gets a chance to actually really think about what he's doing. Okay, he's going to swing me back again. It's going to pretty much use up all my energy. Okay. Oh, shit. Ah, fuck. Oh. Oh. I fell off. Yeah, down here. Come on. There we go. Got it. Got it. <sighs> yeah, the Colossi, I believe, are made from, like, stone and flesh. They're, they're, they're mythical beasts. Yeah, the, the 3D camera is actually really good. I don't usually think about it when it's done right. It's one of those things that you think about how bad, like, the, I don't know, the camera is in Mario 64 or whatever, but you don't think about it when it's good because you don't have to. It's just, it is. Come on, stop. Just turn the game music up. I'm sorry, I forget that this actually has a different game audio than, like, um... Flash games. I turn it up, it's doubled. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna chill here for a second, hopefully, he doesn't buck me too much. Okay, there we go. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Oh, fuck. Come on. Don't do this. Don't do this. Chill out. Chill the fuck out. Calm down. This game is amazing, and you should definitely play it. It's why it's one of my favorite games of all time. Like, I'm not controlling the camera at all. This is just the camera that the game go. Oh! Okay. Okay. That fucking hurt. Hopefully he doesn't notice me. He's gonna notice me. Senpai, please don't notice me. Okay. Not doing... too much to... I mean, the camera does have its bad points, but it's overall fairly good. And there's ways you can get it to work better than others. Alright, here we go. Nope. Oh. So we gotta switch up spots. Oh. Please stop this. Whoa, whoa, okay. I was just praising the camera and now we're inside him? Where the fuck am I? I think I'm on the inside of him. I've somehow glitched the game to be inside of him. Okay, I had to drop out because somehow I glitched inside of him. That was fucking weird. Have I ever heard of the Monster Hunter series? I did a video on one of them, like the first one, but I didn't really care for it because there's no online community for the first Monster Hunter anymore. Um, that was that was weird. I'm not a huge fan of Monster Hunter, to be honest. 
Um, it, too much grinding. I don't like the kind of grindy JRPG thing. like it when I can just, you know, my skill level is what decides whether or not it dies or not. But I gotta go kill like a thousand T-Rexes in order to whatever. Yeah, that's a, that was a first for me as well. Oh, okay. I think what happened was I basically grabbed onto the side of the beard, like the underside of his beard. I got around behind it somehow. If I can just climb up his shoulder here, I'd be pretty happy. Yeah, it's one of the reasons that I like Dark Souls as well. Um, this game is very Dark Soulsy in a lot of ways. I don't just like aesthetically, not so much gameplay wise. It's not very Dark Souls in gameplay. I mean, there's a lot of rolling. The bosses are amazing, but... I'm willing to bet that one of his points is on his... Okay, can you, uh... Can you take, like, five chill pills? It would be appreciated. I'm gonna, um, try and climb up him and get onto his shoulders again so I can take a break. Oh, no. Please don't do this. I'm gonna run out of energy again. Come on. No. Oh, shit. Fuck. Back of the knee, maybe? Looks like his knees are fairly well protected. I think it's his hands. Let's see if I can find it. No, that does seem to be him. I was more specifically asking where his points were, but thank you. Shining your sword reveals his weak spots. It's got to be on his back then, right? Breath of the Wild borrowed the climbing mechanics. Is there one on his chest? Possibly. Just skip the whole beard thing by going straight up his side like this. And then, oh. Oh, fuck. Okay. Oh. Oh, shit. There it is. Found it. It's on his back. That's why I was pointing directly at his chest when I used the sword. It's right. It's just slightly down from where it pointed out and also on his back. I will prefer to go for the power stabs. That should do it. Oh. There we go. Oh. Oh. Shit. Sorry, just looking at the Twitter post from the, the stream I just did. It'll be yesterday's video on After Hours, but, uh, holy fuck. Really hope one of them gets back to me. Problems. Fucking problems. There's no way to escape the black tentacles. Oh, in one of them there is, maybe. It's probably, uh... 
So can we discuss that Dorman is Nimrod backwards? I guess it is, isn't it? <sighs> would that not be sequence breaking? I don't know what would happen. Maybe you could glitch them out. I don't know how it works. The game intentionally lets you try to outrun them once you associate with them not being good. By next foe is... ...an uh, hidden ruin in the lake. A ripple of thunder lurks underwater. And the shrine of the silver monkey. Wanderer's just like, what the fuck? Anyway, aggro. Hold on, I'm gonna try and catch this bird. Yay, there we go! Oh, hey. Ah, uh, ow. Okay. The water snake time. Water Snake is not one of my favorites, but I think it's better than definitely two of the small ones. The, uh... Woo. When you get it to recapture, it just did something weird with the audio. There we go. Should be better now. That's not how birds work. Listen. Yes, it is. This is the first one that actively tries to kill you. They all kinda do. I mean, I guess so, yeah. The crackles are from uh, a shitty capture card, but it's better than, uh... It's honestly fucking better than Avermedia. And that's sad, because it, uh, it's a built-in capture card. The Avermedia? This one is just like... I got it at fucking, like, Office Depot or something. It's so that way you can, um... Get your VHS tapes onto... DVD. It's like fucking shit, but you know, whatever. Yeah, I'm using a dazzle to capture. It's, it's, don't yeah. recommend it, but I recommend it over. Yeah. Is that one of them? No, it's just a regular lizard. Okay. Um, regular old yeah. lizards. I've got the crackles and I'm talking about lizards. I may or may not be Vinny. Whoa, that is straight up a fucking cliff. Okay. Let's just go around then. Yeah, so you can save your porn VHS tapes onto DVD. Yeah. Me and Tilda were out thrift store shopping the other day. I th guess it was Saturday, yeah, so it was yesterday. Well, what's weird is, like, in these, some of these thrift stores, like, basically someone will die and they'll give, you know, the family will go and find it and just sell it, like, boxes and boxes of stuff, probably not looking at what any of it is. And, uh, this one place we went to had just, like, fucking bookcases filled with Playboy magazine. But it was like from 1960 something, so like, it's just sort of interesting to think about that all of these women who are half naked are all like, probably old enough to be your, your grandmother. Also, we went to a fucking cat cafe. That was great. Cat cafes are the jam. I saw cats, we pet cats. Um, all of the food was like some vegan shit. Um... And all the, the, the vegan stuff was just... I don't know. The problem with vegan stuff and vegetarian stuff... I don't have a problem with it, but it was all like soy based. They didn't have milk. Unless if it was like coconut milk, which wasn't too bad. It's ended up what I got with my mocha. Um, but you don't go to a cat cafe because of the food, you know? You go there because they have cats. And it, it's really cute because they do it where you can adopt. Um, so they've since, um, I guess last year, they've um, gotten like 300 adoptions through them. Soy milk, I'm sure, is very good and very good for you, but I'm incredibly allergic to soy, so I'm not going to drink it. Um, that's just not gonna fucking happen. 
Um, name a Frozen game that wasn't made yet. I don't think that... Ha I don't know how you could. Honestly? Where does Rev live? I live in Austin, Texas. So, you know. But yeah, they've done 300-something adoptions since they got started last year. And that, that, that's pretty fucking cool. I mean, the cats, they eat, like, you know, hard food. They're, they're, they're eating, like, you know, standard cat food. But the people are eating, like, soy and, and shit. I don't know. It was good. Are you going to see Sausage Party? And why not? No, because I don't fucking hate myself. And if I'm gonna pay 20, like 12 bucks to go see a movie or whatever, get popcorn and all the whole jam, I'm gonna go see a movie that I actually fucking wanna see. And let me tell you, it ain't Sausage Party. That's why I don't wanna go see a lot of movies. The, the price to go see a movie is just not worth having to sit near people I don't want to sit near, you know? Last movie I saw was on a plane. Um, before that, it was a movie that I found, like, on fucking Netflix. It was The Truman Show, which is pretty good. What's better, sweet tea or unsweetened tea? Um, I just like straight from the bag tea, you know? Um, if you gotta do, like, sweeteners and stuff, it's probably not as good. Am I going the right direction? I feel like I'm not. It's, it's generally speaking over here. Um, yeah, this is right. All right, aggro. I gotta go this one alone. Cause you're not into like water. Aim down. Oh yeah, you're probably right. Hold on. He down there? I don't see him. Maybe I can just do this. Can we see him? Look for him. He's big. He's a snake. I, I like, um, I like loose leaf tea. Um, I make tea. Uh, well, Adagio makes tea, and then I made uh, a recipe that I liked, and then I'm, I'm selling it, and they give me kickbacks for it. But, uh, it's good. That's pretty much the only tea I drink now. I'll drink a black tea, though, you know? Oh, there he is. There he is. Now, if we can get him to come out. This guy always confused me a little. Should we get closer before we try engaging? Nah. It looks like we're gonna have to. Alright. It's a water boss, yeah. So I guess it is like the water temple of this game. Yes, you've said that several times now, Roasted Nuts. Or Roast Nuts. And I've ignored you every single time. There might be a reason. I'm sure that game exists, but I don't think it was meant for children. 
Yeah, we're doing pretty fucking good, Tim. I I'm enjoying that. But I will, uh, I will get it set up so that way we have the new emotes. I'm sorry, the, the new emotes are not available yet. Just haven't had time to work on them. Uh, looking for jobs and stuff like that. Might have gotten one. Might have found one. It's an internship, but you know what? It pays ten bucks an hour. And, uh, that might be good enough. Where'd he go? You don't want to grab the spines. I don't know if that's obvious or not, but... Yeah, this guy's pretty scary because you do have to kind of like bait him out using your body. Internship is for design. Oh. Hold on. Oop. Get away from the electricity. Ah. No, I'm on. Sorta. Of. Okay, we're on. We're on. Now if I can get my sword out, if it'll let me. I gotta come up for air. Alright, where is this first one? Most of this one is about holding your breath. Well, you have enough time for your streams and videos and art if you work 10 bucks an hour. Um, hopefully, it's the general idea. You know, I gotta be real. I'm gonna do the best I can. Oh. I can't really move while he's underwater. I don't see the, the spots. Do you guys? They'll be like bright tattoo looking things. Oh, shit. Hopefully this doesn't electrocute me. Just outside the electrocution range. Weak spots are under the tiny fin things. Okay. Oh, shit. This is gonna hurt. Ugh. Yeah, there it is. I think I might have to start at the front. Am I a sexy little baby? Oh, is that one there? There's one, you just walk by it. It may not be active yet. It's got the wrong symbol. Maybe there's one on the tip of his tail. We can go from there. No, okay. You gotta work up from the boss back. Are you sure? It's easier to go backwards than it is forward. One at every spine. Hit the scar things to take out the lightning. Okay, so they're not actual points. I just use them for taking out the lightning. Okay, gotcha. It's a giant eel, not a water snake. That would make a great deal more sense on why it's electrified. Alright, I'm going to move next time. Okay, I think I stopped the electrocution on this one. The mini spots deal a bit of damage. I'll take it.
As long as it stops the electricity before he gets up again. Ugh. Elect electric eels are not actually eels, they're actually knife fish. Not an expert in these things. Oh fuck, he's, he's going to drown me. That's his objective right now. Try and keep me off. Oh fuck, I've gotta get up for air. Really far down. Do I know how to jump stab? I don't think I can do it on this boss, can I? With his lights out, it's a little bit harder to see where he is. But, uh, hopefully we can do this without getting killed. Try not being directly in front of his mouth would be preferred. Okay. Here we go. Okay, and we're up again. Almost. He's not coming up enough for me to actually get air. There we go. Holy fuck. I didn't think I was going to get any air. Oh, god damn it. <sighs> I don't think you can actually take drowning damage, but it does definitely freak you out. Yeah, I guess try holding your breath every time we go underwater and see if you can actually do it. Obviously don't if you have, like, some asthma condition or something, but, you know. I used to do that with Mario 64. I think a lot of kids did. I don't know if I'm grabbed onto anything or not. I am, good. Ah, <sighs> <sighs> fuck. I missed. <clears throat> Thought I was outside the range. Oh god. Shit. I'm very low on health. I'm backing off because I don't know if I can actually handle the amount of damage that he'd be able to do in one of the shocks. Did I do it? Okay, I did. Oh, shit. He's gone under. Just gotta get around to... Alright, I'm on his head now. There we go. The jumping stab was worth it. Thank you for reminding me that's a thing in this game. I think I actually got the one off before he actually dived down again. There we go.
this is one of the ones that I really feel bad for. Some of the bigger, like, human-looking ones I don't feel as bad for, but this one... This one I feel bad. I don't know if you can actually swim away from this. I don't think you can. Someone was saying in chat that there's a way to swim away from one of these. It gives you a little bit more time, just because it's sinking to the bottom. And the veins are coming up, but... Oh. Just in case if you didn't have a fear of water yet. Alright, let's do like uh one more and then uh we'll check the art and then we'll we'll bail. That one I feel bad for because you really get up in its face. Rev surgency win. What is rev surgency? Do you mean insurgency? I kinda got tired of that game. The community is, is pretty okay, but I don't know. They're nice enough. I'm not gonna see Suicide Squad. I'm not really interested. I'm not interested in really any movie that's coming out right now, I don't think. Uh, not gonna see Suicide Squad, not see, gonna see Ghostbusters, not gonna be seeing um, Sausage Party. It just None of them sound interesting to me. Not enough that I need to pay money for, you know? I'm kind of a cheap ass as part of it. Deadpool was good. I think that was the last movie I watched in movie theaters. Thy next foe is a tale trapped without a pale, deep within the forest. Deep within a pale, deep within the, you know what, whatever. Fuck it, a shadow that crawls on the walls. One of the shittiest bosses in this game. And the shrine of the silver monkey. Last time I think I played Insurgency was probably when I last streamed it, honestly. Within a pale. The shrine of the... Would you hate if there was a Frozen Flash game called Elsa Takes a Shit? I would not be surprised. There's some Frozen Flash games that are legitimately, like, fetish games. And they usually don't end up on those kids games websites ones that are a little bit more um ambiguous uh will but the ones that are like straight up porn will not which is good at least the the chinese bootleggers or whoever's making it i think we've discovered that it's probably china based on the ketchup pizza incident but i don't know the L legends of the hidden temple tv movie trailer what the Silver Snakes! I... I don't know. That's a very specific issue, though. Uh, Bifrosig. Um, and, and that's fine, like, you know, if you don't want to go to movies then don't I don't know I don't I don't feel like there's been any movies that I really missed out on by not going to the movie theater there's a TV movie coming to Nick called legend of the hidden temple oh are you just trying to capitalize on on 90 kids 90s kids because I, I think that's what you're doing Now, I think this is one of the most boring bosses because it's basically just average size. It's not big, which makes it kind of, like, weird. Yeah, yeah Hey Arnold is, uh, is coming back. I saw that. I'd watch that just for the sake of, like, nostalgia, but I'm not going to go and get... Damn, damn, this game is pretty. Like, that looks good even now. It's a little bit blurry. But, I mean, this game is like 10 years old, am I right? It's pretty fucking old. Ooh. Hold on there. Yeah. 
Hey Arnold was a little bit depressing, but you know what? It was good. When did you change the capture settings? I didn't. This is just what the game looks like here. The water looks really fucking legit. Sorry, I'm just getting distracted. Wasn't this game like 2003-ish? I don't know, someone will have to double check. But this game looks really good for how old it is. Deadpool was good. I like the Deadpool movie. Hey Arnold is kind of like King of the Hill for kids. What? Maybe? I don't know. Oh, is it the turtle one? Are we on to the turtle one? I don't think we are. We can get some sunlight so that way we can, uh... Okay, it's over there. I think I got this aggro. Uh, alright. So it's over here, it says. Reboot is getting a reboot. You know, I feel like that was definitely a game that survived more upon my nostalgia and my, you know, me being a kid than it was actually good. You know? You stay there, aggro. You can't swim. It's okay, I'll be back. It's okay, chill. I got this. What the fuck was that? Is that a goddamn shark? Is there a fucking shark in this water? Did anyone else see that fucking shark? Is there a fucking- I'm getting the fuck out of here. Why am I looking for the shark? Fucking swim, dude. Nope. 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 Wait, why am I fucking concerned about a shark? I just beat the shit out of a huge ass snake. Bring it, shark, dude. Watch that clip back. Double check. Right when I said, is that a shark? A couple of seconds before, I think there was like a shark or something in the water with me there. I swear to God, I saw a goddamn shark though. That was a fucking shark or some shit. I don't know shit about fish though, so it could have been anything. Fuck you. Anyway. Am I going the right way? Okay. Is it... Is it in here? Oh. Like, directly here, you say. Don't see it. Do I need to go on the other side? I gotta go into the temple? I would imagine so. Just gotta figure out how to navigate inside first. I haven't seen a door yet, but... You know, I'm also dumb. There it is! fall down the stairs. Okay. Um. I think there's a quick way across here and I'm gonna try it. You can climb all the way around by going straight forward or you can use this. Alrighty. Oh. I love the character animation quality that they went into this fucking game. He runs like a goober because he's not a fucking fighter. He's just a guy. Like, and that's what I love about this game is he's not like strong, large, huge, the, the action hero. He's just like this puny ass, weak ass kid, you know? And, you know, when you're a kid and you're a puny ass, weak ass kid, like, this is great. Like, I could do this shit. But yeah, this is one of my least favorite Colossi. We might do another depending on what the next one is.
this one I've glitched out. There's actually a video of that on After Hours, but it's really, really far back. Or uh, not on After Hours, on the Highlight Channel. Why is it shitty? Because they're Colossi, right? The turtle one is next. The turtle one's pretty cool. We could do the turtle. I'm just gonna take it real fucking easy so we don't fuck this up. Just walk along the razor's edge. Trying to sneak up on it a little bit. You can't do that move, man. Just pull yourself up. There you go. Okay. doesn't know I'm here yet. Gotta wait for him to turn around. Might want to get a little bit lower. Oh shit. There we go. Hopefully I can do this without breaking my fucking legs. Oh, he's found me. Oh, oh shit. Hi there. No, you don't. Oh, shit. All right, I've aggroed him. Oh, shit. I've kind of forgotten what you needed to do, but I remember now. There are Minecraft sex videos on YouTube. I I'm aware. Trust me. You, you, you do not want to know what kind of ass box I get sometimes. All right. Oh shit, it's gas. <sighs> There's even smaller ones. I would say this is like medium size. Would it be okay if I turned you into a meme? Sure. Depends. But sure. If you have mean creating capabilities. I gotta get him to climb up some. I'm gonna just get back so that way he can, uh... We're all memes now. Is this the one that's like... Blind? I believe I can shoot his limbs in order to make him trip. Come on. Up here. 
Oh shit. Oh. I had to jump off a little bit so that way I wouldn't take damage from the poison. But, uh, hopefully I've pissed him off enough now that he's, uh, gonna climb up here. The trick is to get him to fall on his back, but we gotta climb, get him to climb up here first. He's not really cooperating with me. Might have to get him to climb up some more. We'll piss him off from up higher. Oh yeah, I can whistle at him. I forgot about that. I don't have to try and aim arrows at him or anything. I can just climb all the way to the top. Hopefully he follows me up here. Oh, shit! Can't hit his. Gotta move. Try shooting up across from him when he climbs up. Yeah, I think that's the trick. So this thing's a giant lizard gecko? I believe so, yeah. Your, your gauge is gonna be huge after you eat it. Yeah, probably. Am I going to play Flash games? You kind of missed those. Yeah, I did. Oh shit, that's going to hurt. Come on. Come on, come on. There we go. Oh, shit. Ah, ow, ow, ow. Oh, fuck. Please don't glitch the game. Please don't glitch the game. Ah, uh, okay. Ah, fuck. Dead. Wander, get up. Okay, let's go. You exhausted the spot? Possibly. 
close. I got a decent amount of damage done in that, but I really fucked myself up, so I need a better way of getting down. Because jumping down the side like that, I almost glitched out. If you want to see what the glitch looks like, search way, way, way back into my highlights channel, and you'll find it. Um, I think it's called Shadow of the Colossus Glitch. It's... Actually, the video quality is about the same as this. Um... Don't go up too high. I gotta get him up high enough that he, when he falls, he does damage to himself. And he's down for a second, but... Where is he? Come on. Oh, he's aiming at me. I gotta get him to go up the opposite side for me. Is there a way you can drop down on top of him? Yes, but he's made out of electricity, pretty much. Okay, where is he? Where the fuck is he? Oh, there he is. Okay. This is the best way to get down, I think. Do you think Hiccup's model got... Inspired by this guy? I don't think so. Come on, get let me up, let me up, let me up. Come on, don't do this game. It's hard enough to fucking do this shit. Stab him in the dick. Oh. Put a condom made out of rubber on your head and dive bomb his ass. I mean, I guess that would protect me from the electricity, but I have a feeling that it might hurt me in other ways. Uh, also, where am I going to get that fucking big of a condom? That's, that's actually a huge condom when you think about it. I mean, yeah, condoms stretch a lot, but not, not without some pinching, you know? A little bit of pinching on your temples. Would it protect you? I don't know. Probably not. Oh shit, there he is. Oh fuck. Really hope he doesn't know that I'm here. That would be very inconvenient for me. Okay. Down we go. It's best when you're on kind of a similar size, or side, that he is, because then you can kind of... There we go, there's one. Let's see if we can get another good stab off before he gets up. One more? Come on, one more. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Uh, out of here. Okay, we almost got this. Wooden condoms, what the fuck? 
I don't imagine that would feel good for anyone involved. One more time. I basically just need one more hit. Way. Those landed really close. This boss is a bit tedious. It's one of my least favorites for that reason. Where's the gap on this one? Slot, stop flooding chat with condoms. I feel like it's the kind of discussion that would happen in my chat. So, I'm not too ultra perturbed, but yeah, let's maybe. I don't know. Okay. Last time. Last time. Come on, there we go. Dick stab for the win. One more. Oh, fucked up the stab. Oh, this is not the right spot anymore. Go, sit up, fuck. It's fine, Mafa. It's fine. Don't worry about it. You don't have to purge. It's okay. Are the Colossi really the only enemies you run into this game? I mean, yeah. They're, they're birds that you can ride. There's no real point in doing so. Um, and then there are lizards. But they don't really count. They're just there to be a way of getting extra... Um, extra grabbing power. Hey, Mike. Have you seen this game before, man? This game is fucking great. We were just talking about medieval condoms for some reason. I don't fucking know why. You know how these things go. That was pretty good auto-aim. There's no auto-aim in this game, by the way. Like, if I get a shot, it's just because I got the shot. Okay. This game is great. It's one of the best games of all time, in my opinion. And this is one of the worst bosses for this game. Come on. Down we go. It's gonna hurt like a bitch. No, 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 no. Don't you dare get up. Don't you dare get up. There we go. Fuck. Uh, all right, let's get the fuck out of here. Nope. Let's do one more since Mike just got here. Next boss is a little bit cooler than that one. <sighs> we're at seven almost. Well, now we're at eight, so we'll be up to nine. After this. Gutscene as well.
Look at his face, by the way. Anytime you get a chance to look at his face, look at it. Mike is a cool dude. You guys should go watch his channel, too. It's uh, M6000W. Plays in a band with Vinny. Cutscene's happening, so I'm going to show now. It's a little rumble when I touched your face. My next foe is the land where trees merry grow. It sleeps in a dry lake bed. A rude awakening in the shrine of the silver monkey. Anyway. Yeah, I mean, she's straight up dead. Or in a coma or something. Yeah, basically we're making a pact with the devil. We said, hey man, we need you to, to save this girl. And he's like, look, humans are mortal. You die. And, you know, I'm kind of tied up at the moment. We can't, I can't really do anything. And, uh... Do I like bagels? That's an odd question, but not the weirdest one I've ever been asked. Um, yeah, they're okay. I like cinnamon raisin bagels. Those are good. Does it qualify as the lizard dome? That was one of my favorite rev memes that didn't take hold. This game is amazing for a PS2 game. It, uh, it, they're a little pop in there, but, you know, for the most part, pretty solid. This turtle is also not a very good one. Uh, but I feel like it's a little bit better than, uh... Am I killing the Colossi to save the girl? Basically. It's never- I don't think it's ever explained what the relationship between Wander, the main character, and the girl is, or who the girl is, or why I care. But, yeah. Dorman really never explains whether or not he's good or bad. He's just a sort of assumed to be, you know, malevolent because, um, well, spoilers. They're in some sort of relationship. Sister, um, you know, girlfriend, princess, um, who knows? Not mom, that's for clear. I mean, they're too close in age, but uh, something like that, you know? Where are the other people? There are no other people here. We're, we're going to, the, like, the ends of the earth in order to do this. This is like a forbidden area. This is a forbidden land. Yeah, I don't think anyone thinks they're evil. I mean, like, fuck, even in the Bible, like, Satan doesn't, like, think he's that evil. He kind of thinks he's a good guy and that God's being the asshole, but you know, most people would disagree. Yeah, no one's allowed here. You're not supposed to come here. This is the land of, you know, the Colossi. This is forbidden. But, you know, we're here.
I'm very sorry, Zane. I, I hope everything is okay. I'm sure your dog was a good dog and everything will be fine. Okay, time to move, time to move, time to go. Where is he? Oh, time to go, time to go, time to go, time to go! This is a fight where you like to stand on aggro. I forgot you could do that. Come on, aggro. Let's move. Come on. Gotta get him over one of these, but he's not one to move. Could probably get him closer to the one that he's right near right now. Oh, shit. Okay. Almost did it. Come on. Shit. That guy's just got to start up again soon. Shit. Run, aggro. Aggro. Okay, he can still shoot me here, so he doesn't want to move. I just need to get him to move a little bit farther forward. I'm trying to get him on the steam vents. Yeah. Pil Might have to just do it without getting him onto this particular steam vent because I can't get him to move forward unless I'm like, oh! might actually lose this one. Oh shit! Can I climb up its tail? I think I can. Can the horse die? Uh, no.
There we go. I think I got it. Aggro, you might want to chill. Yeah. There you go. Steam vent, come on. Wait, where is he falling? There we go. There we go. There we go. Forget where I need to climb on to. There we go. Okay, I think I've got a good grip now. go. We're okay. Aggro, you're gonna wanna hide. This is not a good place for you. Uh, uh. Let's not spoil things for people. Okay? Even if I know what's gonna happen, we don't have to spoil it for other people in the chat. Ooh, ooh. There it is. Oh, shit. I might have to let go and drop back. Aggro, what are you doing? Get out of here. He'll never stop bucking. I just gotta do as much damage as I can before I lose my grip. This is a little bit like never ending story. A little bit like Dark Souls in a lot of ways. A little bit of the I'm hoping if he flings me, he flings me backwards rather than to the side. I'm gonna try and take a, a quick breather. <sighs> Might be able to do it actually. One more shot. There we go. Aggro, please move. Giant ass turtle going down. Oh. Aggro. 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 Let's get the fuck out of here. Hi, girl. Oops, oh, shit. A little late there, aggro. That was pretty good. That was a pretty good, uh, I think that was one cycle. So that was just number nine right there. I think that's probably a good place to stop for now. I gotta wake up early in the morning. Not sure if I'm going to get that job or that internship or not, so. Uh, if I can, that would be great. If not, um, we'll see. I'll figure something else out. But I've got a, um, a thing tomorrow that'll help me find another job just in case.
Oh god, there actually was a fifth um, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle. It was like non-canonized now. It was um, Aphrodite, I think was her name. Uh, she was the pink turtle. It was fucking awful. It was in the live action version that had a very, very short run as a TV series. Thy next foe is... An isolated sand dune. Its tracks are well hidden. Shaking the earth, it gazes upon the Venus de Milo. There you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look up Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Venus. It's fucking awful. She's totally an OC character. <sighs> it's fucking... Jesus. Oh, so bad. Um, this is probably one of my favorite colossi, but I think I'm gonna wait until next time to do it. Uh, this game is amazing. If you have a PS3 and you can get it, I think someone said that it was on the, the st like, PS store, whatever. Um, uh, if you see this game, I would recommend buying it. This is on the PS2. The PS3 version, I've heard, has some problems. But, uh, definitely definitely worth it how do I save I forget what the button is is it select I think I have to kneel in front of it right oh hi can we talk about how you didn't save me when the tendrils were coming after me that'd be great um, does anyone remember what I need to press? It's, it's not si start. Square to save? Okay. No? No? It's one of these buttons. Thanks, man. I'll see you tomorrow. Are you streaming after this, or are you just going to bed? Circle? Oh, there it is. I just wasn't in the right spot to press circle. I know it already saved, but I'm like one of those guys that gets really nervous and wants to make sure that I save, because otherwise it's bad. Anyway. Uh, save is complete. Now we can turn off the uh, PS2. And uh, let me give you a BRB screen region for a minute. We'll we'll continue with um, Frozen Flash games next time. Uh, well, next Saturday at one ish, maybe later. I don't know. Honestly, like a lot more people showed up when I streamed later, so maybe I should do that. Maybe I should base my decisions based on analytics like an actual person who was smart would do rather than just doing things randomly like a dumbass would do um probably gonna play something offline okay um there are two new pieces of art let me show you them uh there is this one by pink uh, I'll, I'll definitely be doing more Stardew and stuff over the week. Um, but, yeah. I also at some point need to start recording some of the things that I said I was going to do. And there's this, there are a couple of games that I want to do, um, videos for that I can't do online. So, just to kind of separate it out so every week isn't a highlight reel of Flash games. Probably going to combine a few streams worth, but should be fine anyway uh this one's by pink it says vineheart on it um and it's of my character from stardew valley which is pretty damn cute someone uh i believe they posted it on the vine sauce discord um and it's it's pretty cool um and they were talking about it so I i'm happy to see this one just me as a farmer wearing a straw hat uh, and then we've got this one by Peach Panda. Let me make sure that the screen region is right. It's not. Oh, 
Always make sure you stick around for the uh, the art, because art is hard and it's hard to get noticed. But this one's by Peach Panda. Considering the amount of time that you had to draw this, this is pretty damn good. Honestly, I like the um, the style. It's good. I love being drawn in my favorite games. It makes me feel good. But yeah. Alrighty. Um, that is the art for today. That was from Peach Panda. The other one was from Pink. Uh, not the artist Pink, I'm pretty sure. You know, because there's the artist known as Pink. Which is different than, uh, yeah. Uh, I will try and make sure that there is a new, um, the new emotes are up soon. But, yeah. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'm going to run an ad or two or three or however many will let me while I press the three minute ad button. So if you get a shit ton of ads, I'm sorry. But it helps pay for my life and pay for the stream. So thank you guys for watching. You guys are amazing. I will see you next time. Goodbye. That was really fucking loud. I'm sorry about that. See you next time.